Billy, congratulations. You've committed to the club. You've signed a three-year contract with the Reds. First of all, mate, how do you feel that you've decided to commit your future to the club? Yeah, absolutely buzzing. Um, you know, to continue working with uh, Eugene and, and the rest of the boys, um, even working under Carl, it's been an honour and um, a, a real pleasure. So, just yeah, really excited, to be honest. Um, what were the major factors um, to uh, get you to this stage mentally, to, to commit to the club, mate? I think it was a no-brainer, to be honest. Um, every player wants to play football and, you know, now I'm back in the team and, um, yeah, we just want to achieve our goals and make them finals this year and hopefully do better next year. Now, you are back in the team. Um, Joe left us earlier this year. Talk to us, Delhi, about how you coped mentally with that step from uh, being a, a number two to stepping into the first team. How did you find that? Oh, I found it really exciting, obviously. Um, even for Joey, it's such a phenomenal move for him and he's doing exceptionally well. Um, but for myself personally, it was just to come back in, show everyone what I could do again. And um, yeah, it's been a real pleasure to be, be back out there. And I felt like I'll just kind of continue to improve each game and build on my confidence. So yeah, really enjoying it. <coughs> Talk to us about how important has Eugene Galekovic been in this process? He's worked very closely with, with the goalkeeping uh, camp. A um, couple of the boys have gone overseas for bigger and better things, which proves how well Eugene has gone. Just how important has Eugene been to you? Yeah, he's, been, he's played a massive role. Um, it was one of the main reasons why I came over here as a 21-year-old. Um, you know, the proof's in the pudding that he's one of the best in the league, if not the best. Um, and yeah, just wanted to continue working and um, yeah, just really enjoying it. So Adelaide United have, have shown faith in your abilities by offering you this three-year contract extension. Um, how does it feel to have that club's trust and support behind you? And how does this motivate you to continue improving and delivering strong performances like that you have been recently? Yeah, um, it's massive, you know. Um, I just want to continue working. I, I love being here in Adelaide and love the lifestyle, but also love hard work. And um, we're a good bunch of boys here and just hope we can just continue on uh, moving in the right direction. Now, it's probably fair to say this season hasn't gone entirely to plan, but it's been a, a, a successful season for yourself. Um, looking forward, what are your personal goals and aspirations? Have you got the Socceroos on your radar? What's next for Delhi? Yeah, for sure. I think it would be a no-brainer to say I wouldn't want to be in the Socceroos squad. Um, every young footballer aspires to be a Socceroo and uh, definitely want to, want to try and go overseas for sure. I think that's the strength of this club is selling plays and um, it definitely is motivation seeing boys go overseas. So there are definitely things on my radar for sure. And lastly, Delhi, what message have you got for the for the for the fans? You know, every time you run out onto the pitch and you're running towards each goal and you get that buzz, what message have you got for the um, Red Army fans? It's definitely extremely special being out there to play in front of the um, front of the Red Army, and um, yeah, I'm looking forward to continuing on, and um, hopefully we can win something for sure.